on flex pay. Uh, okay, we're ready to do it. What day is it today? I, it's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. It is Wednesday. And what's so special about April? Uh, it's it says, customer like, appreciation month. Yes, yeah. See, you got them both right. It's <laughs> customer did. appreciation month right here on I didn't even right have to look at the HSN. thing. I, I didn't have to know. look at the big sign that says it right in front of us. I know. Well, uh, it is. Yeah. It is. And so that means that all month long, HSN yeah. Cares is giving away $1,000 every single day for charities, not just charities, but charities that are nominated by our customers. Yeah, now today's charity was chosen by Doreen J. I'm going to go with Busey. Sure. I think I think it's Busey. You can uh, call in she, if we need to pronounce it differently. Yeah, Doreen. if you want to come and yell at me, you can. Uh, now she nominated the African Heritage Solution of St. Louis. What a wonderful charity! They produce an annual festival designed to bring the community together. And Doreen uh, says, after attending the festival for a few years, she had the opportunity to serve on the planning committee, and both her and her mom uh, plan to uh, help with the festival over and over. She says her mother is 82 years young. I love that. Congratulations I hope to that's mom. That's a picture of her mom dancing like i love to think about that st awesome. louis is one of my favorite cities yep. of all and i just we just thank you so much doreen and the american heritage association of st louis will be receiving today's one thousand dollars from hsn cares so you can visit the hsn cares page on hsn.com to learn more about all of the charities that have been selected this month 30 wait yeah, yeah. 30 days half september april june and november so 30 when short february is done all the rest have 31. Nice. Yeah, well, we're tight on that. You know, we, are, yeah. we know that. We know it. Yeah. We know. You got to know that when you have, this when month. you have family. You got to know what. What? Because <laughs> right. is that month up thirty one days? Anyway, uh, all right. I, I have to run because we have the most amazing way to chop your veggies. Yeah. I know that's a great way to start in the morning, but you know, <laughs> if you're making omelets and stuff like that, yeah. And you, young lady with a really cute shirt, have hey, Hillary to. Scott. That's so awesome. Isn't you it cute? have to talk about our today's special. I get to talk about our yeah. today's special. This is the Roku, and this is the Roku Ultra. It's we just watched a guy take his coffee. By the way, made with hot chocolate. There it is. Uh, yeah. So uh, this is the Roku Ultra. It's a 4K streaming media HDR player. It has voice search. This is the one that I have, and here's why I like it. You can take that remote and literally say, um, I don't know, Bruce Willis to it, and it will pull up every Bruce Willis movie. You could say HSN Today, and it will instantly show you where you can find HSN today. It's so simple to use. It even has a little private listening option. So if you're watching at night or, uh, you know, you're watching in the I don't know, living room where my son is always practicing his guitar and I want to be able to watch TV, you can actually plug that right into the remote. You can easily find the remote as well. And what's so special about the Roku Ultra is it up converts your TV to 4K HD quality. And I was just asked before I came on here, can I use this with like a TV that's not a smart TV? Actually, that's exactly what it's for. If you have a smart TV, great. You'll love the quality of this and how you can stream anything, your Netflix, your Amazon, all those kinds of movie channels. It also has um, free movies, 500,000 movies and TV shows, 4,500 channels. But if you don't have a smart TV, if you have an older TV, you hook up your Roku and instantly that TV is completely updated. Now you can stream. Now you can turn your movie and your your TV into um, that streaming device. You don't need cable. Uh, it's a huge customer pick. We'll get a full presentation at nine. But guys, up next. All right. Thanks, Shannon. Uh, you know. Chopping is one of the toughest things you learn whenever you go to culinary school. It's the first thing they, they kind of teach you is to have knife skills. Not everybody has them. It can be a real challenge. But you don't need a knife when you have the master slicer. This thing is amazing. John Florell is here. I learned uh, when working with John is to just let him start chopping stuff because it's amazing <laughs> what he does. You don't really even have to say anything in this demonstration, and you get it. Instead of one knife, look at all the little knives you have in there doing the job, and they do it all at once. So something like an onion, you're not going to see John and I crying. Nope. We are not going to that. That stuff doesn't bother us. And it goes all into the little catch bin yep. down below. It is one of the coolest things ever. And what I love about it is you notice John never touched a knife. All nope. he does is bring the food to the chopper and he pushes it through. I love this. I love this I, item. I do too. It yeah. comes with the lid so you can chop up your veggies ahead of time, put it in the, keep it right in the storage container yeah. with its own lid. You get the three inserts too. Now I'm going to show you real quick. I got to tell you, if the only thing you use it for is 
chopping onions. I think it's worth it. Just I would for buy that. it just for that. But it I like so potatoes too. Yeah, and you know I love the eggs. The yes. Eggs going through deviled eggs. Oh, oh I love yeah. that stuff. But yep. see, anything that grows in layers like cabbage, onions, or celery, when you push it through this little grate here, okay. Now these are razor sharp German stainless steel blades. They do the work for you. You just put your vegetable, fruit, meat, or cheese on top. The lid pushes it through the blades, so your fingers never get close to the cutting blades. And look at this. You can do all kinds of different things. See, anything solid comes out like a french fry right so you can do carrot sticks zucchini spears for a vegetable tray how about uh you know well i'll tell you what how about french fries here i'll put sure. these out here in the front yeah sweet now potatoes yes, be good sweet too potato, right french Can fries I? you can make regular <clears throat> french fries just take a potato place it on top Push down the lid, and it does the work for you. I mean, instant. How long would that take a knife? Why would you? Well, who, who would do that? I'd never with a be knife, able. Right? You would never be able to get that same consistency. Listen, you go to those fast food places. You know, you take the kids. They like these little shoestring French fries. Yeah, baby. Think about it. Oh my At the God. fast food places, they get 95 cents for a four-ounce package of French fries. You That's four dollars a pound for potatoes. <laughs> That's I mean, crazy. If you add that up and figure it out, I mean, what's a potato cost? I know. It's pennies. And it's so much it, better when you do it yourself. Yes. Right. And look at the consistency that you get with the master dicer. It gives you perfect French fries each and every time. But the difference too, it comes with the three inserts. Okay. The one that I've been using has the small holes in it, and you're gonna love this for your, that thin julienne. Sure. If you do any dicing here, how about uh, you can do things like well, here, let me just grab this bowl and I'll show you. I mean, bell peppers. These these little baby bells are delicious when they're Fast. minced up. Yeah. If you've ever bought these things in a supermarket in that little plastic tub already minced up for you, right. think of it, look at, you just look at the prices, okay? Yeah. When you can buy veggies this way, compared to buying them this way, right. it makes a well, huge and difference. And when you buy them pre-chopped, they're never fresh, guys. The, the, right. you need, when you chop a vegetable, you need to eat it right away. Oh, yeah. So having it in a bag is a waste of money. <laughs> no preservatives, yeah. no additives. And look at how fast and, you I do I mean, this. for omelets in the wow. morning, is perfect. In fact, if you're making an omelet right now and you had to dice up, a, a, you know, a, Look at this. You get perfect, perfect dices each and every time. Yep. Because, uh, you know, again, anything that grows in layers will automatically dice. Anything solid comes out like a french fry. Now, I'm going to show you real quick, too, because you mentioned the eggs. All right, watch this. Here, let me switch out this bowl. Okay. I'm going to show you this because this kind of gives you an idea of how the machine works. It's like having 24 little knives all working at the same time. When I push that egg through that blade, <laughs> you can see how it separates. That's awesome. And that's what, I mean, listen, just for making egg salad or tuna fish, chicken salad, homemade potato salad, now you can do this right in the bowl. In fact, add a little mayonnaise. You can dice up some pickle in there. You can and season yeah. it. And then you put the lid the on right and make in your there, egg right? salad yeah. right in the bowl that the machine comes with. I mean, and look at this. Again, that's four or five eggs that I've already and, done. You know what I've noticed, too? It's really hard to mash an egg with a fork. It is. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. And, and I love eggs. It's a pain, so I yeah, actually have this. <laughs> yeah. And I'm telling you, it makes life so much easier. You can chop up. Hey, listen, you can put ham in there. You can oh, do yeah. turkey in there. You can chop all those Mix different right kinds of meats. Yeah, yeah, it's all in one, and it's easy to clean. Hey, John, let me yeah. do a quick break and show them the colors. Sure. And then uh, while you're switching out here, so uh, when you order, by the way, we haven't even started, we haven't talked about the peeler that you get. Oh, you get this, I call it the magic peeler. John will show you that too. So if you order it, you can get it in black. Uh, comes in this turquoise blue, comes in regular uh, navy blue. It comes in this bright green, and then it comes in purple. And of course, the one John's using is red. You're gonna get this little brush that goes with it. This is to clean out the blades because let me tell you, the blades are very, very sharp, gang. So you don't want to sit there with your hand and try to scrub them with a brush. Use this little guy. You just flick it off, rinse it underwater. Yeah. Don't even put it in the dishwasher. It's not worth it. Um, and you also get a lid to go over the bowl, and then you get the peeler. Yep, and we'll and talk about peeler. that in a minute. But the three inserts that the machine comes with, I've been using the one with the small holes. That gives you the fine mincing. Now I'm going to put the blade with the larger <laughs> holes in, and I'll tell you, it, hey, on taco night, this is, guy, this is probably the only machine I've ever seen that'll actually dice a red ripe tomato. I mean, for tacos, yeah. for well, the skin, John, for it's salsa. Like the, it's like with the peppers, right? Yeah. The skin is hard for most knives to get through. All you do is place a half a tomato on top of the blade, press down on the lid, and presto, look at that, you got diced, <laughs> perfect dices yeah. for your bruschetta or for salsa, thick and chunky style salsa. Or here, if you wanted to do, I'm gonna put an onion in here too, because right. if you wanted to make salsa, now you can do it right in the bowl. Or if you wanna make a quick Greek salad, add a little bit of onion like this. Yeah. And then, here, I can take this blade out, 
We're gonna and to insert the blades. You see this little tab right here? You insert it like this, push that tab, it locks it in place. So now, so now this is the slicing blade. I'm gonna place a cucumber on top because I'm gonna make a Greek salad. Do a right. couple cucumbers like this, and now you have your Greek salad recipe or you know all the ingredients. Look all you need that. is a little black olive, some feta cheese, oh uh, your gosh. dressing, and then you snap the lid on top. How about for a picnic, like right? Take and that with that. you. Yeah, it's ready hey. to go right in the in the in the. Uh, in the refrigerator. John, explain to everybody, because a lot of people don't, they sit there and they go, well, you know, this, what if it gets dull? How am right. I gonna, well, well, John told, showed me once why a knife gets dull. Yes. All right, and he's gonna show you well, now. Knives so. go dull because they hit countertops, <laughs> cutting boards, plates and yeah. dishes. That's why your knives go dull. All these blades ever touch are vegetables, fruit, meat, and cheese, so they stay razor sharp. Yeah. So, I mean, you can do all kinds of fun things with this dicer. I mean, all you do is place whatever veggie you want on top. Maybe you're doing an omelet this morning, or maybe you're having a steak dinner and you want to saute some mushrooms, place the mushroom over the blade, press down on the lid, and look at that, guys. you get sliced, perfectly sliced, and I want to show you these. Every slice is exactly the same thickness, so they'll all yeah. cook up at the same time. And they're perfect sizes for, for yes. sauteing mushrooms, and you're going to find the same thing with any of your smaller vegetables. John does radishes, and oh, it, yeah. I'll tell you something. How else would you, you know how hard it is to chop a radish with a knife oh, without chopping the top, <laughs> tip of your thumb off? This makes it you easy. You can do two or three or Look four at radishes yeah. at a time, and all you do is press down on the lid. What the it heck? does the work for you. So if you you want to make a salad, you can make your salad right here in the same bowl. It does all the work for you. But I'll tell you what I love this for. I've got a couple of friends of mine that are bartenders, and I, I gave them these things, gave them one yeah, to, yeah. to use at the bar because when they do their prep work, it's a pain. It takes forever. Oh, yeah, when you're fruit. slicing up your fruit, I know. take a lemon, lime, or orange, place it on top, and press. And look at this. You get perfect pinwheels. That's crazy. Every one is exactly the same thickness, but look at the pinwheel effect that you get. So yeah. for rimming glasses or for sangria, or maybe Pretty. you want to do some infused water. Sure. But the difference now, you can do it a couple of different ways. I mean, if you want a bunch of pinwheels like this, you just place it on top and press. But take a lemon, lime, or orange, and then cut it in half first. And what's gonna happen now, instead of giving you that pinwheel, like the half pinwheel effect, yeah. now, for sangrias. Getting quarters? Or, yep, now yeah. it'll quarter them down like this. So, I mean, it's the perfect addition to a bar if you have one or know somebody that has one because yeah. it just saves you so much time. And listen, guys, you know, the, the big deal here is, is that if you don't know how to use a knife, you don't need a knife. I mean, honestly, I mean, you can use one to take the edges right. off or to cut a tomato in half if you want to do it the way we did, but you're not doing the dangerous slicing, which is the pinpoint blah, 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 you know, where you're, where you're putting your hand down or trying to chop in a radish or a mushroom or an egg, and that... You fumble with that every single time, and you'll never, I don't care if it's Wolfgang or Ming or right. Curtis, I don't care who it is, none of them can ever dice or cut an apple <laughs> perfect quick. every That's time, right. because it's humanly impossible to make, this is possible to make identical slices, so when you're doing things like yeah. the big sub sandwiches, you. right, you know yeah, the big heroes, yeah. Oh, yeah. and you want to do tomatoes mm -hmm. and stuff like that? How about leeks, guy? You ever try and mince leeks with a knife? Forget it takes it. forever, oh. and who wants to drag out that heavy food processor? that takes so much time to set up and clean, with the master dicer, all you do is place the leeks right on top of that yeah. tray, that, that blade and press, and look at this. I mean, yeah. you've got enough there to feed, I don't know. <laughs> That's a Dude, lot of a leeks. A bunch of salads, well, a bunch of soups or stews. And I like mean, you said, to chop and, that by hand, and take yes, you forever. look at the consistency. Perfect. I'll put this out right next to the yeah. diced uh, uh, bell, bell, bell peppers up here. <laughs> I'll get it out. Look yeah. at that. Each piece is exactly the same And that's the size you want leeks. And, yeah. and to be honest, now, that's if you want that's them bigger, you, want you them. can make them right. bigger. You just change out the blade by popping this one out. You go to the larger one, pop that in, and now you get the, you know, bigger french fries, yeah. bigger, uh, you know, diced tomatoes and yeah. onions and cabbage and hey, celery. Hey, John White, I see you put it in on a little bit of an angle. How yes. come you do that? Well, see, potatoes are long one way and short the other, okay? And you want those potatoes to get the length of that potato oh, through there. Oh, I got there. you. Right. Notice so how the lid closes kind of like an alligator. Right. Alligator closes his mouth. Right. So you want to put it on an angle and then push it through like this. Yeah. And look at this. You get oh big, gosh. juicy steak how, fries. How like good would those be? <laughs> like a little olive oil, salt, oh, pepper in the yeah. oven? Oh, my gosh. Throw them on a cookie sheet. All right. You can do this yourself. That's the key. You don't need any special skills. Although John's been doing this for a long time, and he's really good at it. It's the simple. learning curve on this is nothing. <laughs> because once you...
once you start putting it, I actually found, because with mine, yep. I got addicted to it. Oh, yeah. Like, I'm like, I, well, hey, once you use shop, it, it's going in the little, it's going in the machine. It saves so much time, that's the thing. Yeah. I mean, just doing things like this, I mean, how, I, again, if the only thing you use this for, here, let me dump this out here on the tray in the front. If the, if the only thing you use it for is mincing onions, yeah. it's worth it for this alone. I'm going to put that small little mincing insert back in there with the small holes. Right. You place your onion right on top of the, of, of the grate and press, and look at that, you got a half an onion minced perfectly yeah. with no lumps, no humps, no bumps. It comes out perfect for salads, soup, stews, for spaghetti sauce. I mean, it, it, there's no it waste goes either. right into the bowl. You, you notice he's not, you know, he's not fumbling with a knife, so there's no wasted pieces. You ever That's chop right. an onion to get down to the very, very end? Look at and you always throw that piece away because you can't chop it? Look at the consistency. <laughs> Excuse me, the whole onion <laughs> is perfect. Yeah, wow. and again, if you wanted to mix ingredients, when food is cooked or sliced even and uniform, yeah. it cooks up even in uniform. Yep. So instead of with, with a knife, you know how you get that one thick slice that, oh, I, and then one thin slice? I gotta show you this, I almost forgot. You get this peeler I with I know, it we had too. so much fun and chopping, <laughs> we forgot to peel. I almost forgot the about it. The peeler comes Take with it, and this is unlike any you peeler you've seen. You get it with seen. the machine. Yeah. It's a dual-sided peeler. One side has a straight peeler. The other side has a Julianning peeler. So it peels in both directions. You just push it or pull it either way. You can see how quick and easy it is. But whether it's carrots, potatoes, beets, apples, cucumber, pears. But watch the difference now, because when I flip this over, instead of giving you that straight peel, this has the thin Julienne That's peeler. Okay, so now you get that angel hair julienne cut. Yeah, and I, I gotta it. tell you, guy, I mean, I'm looking at the flex pay here. You would pay way more than a flex pay for this peeler. Well, <laughs> that's all first you were of all, I, you I know mean, what? I, I went and bought one of those peelers that peels sideways. Yes. Like most people have. And right? that's a dumb way to peel when you think about it. The angle's all wrong. And you got, and the blade, you know, you're trying to tilt the blade. You can cut backwards and forwards, up and down, doesn't matter. You can't do it wrong. And if you want to make like carrot pasta, oh, yeah. look at what John's or made there. Pasta. Pick it up and show everybody. Well, I mean, John. take a look at that. That look long it. Look. angel hair thin wow. julienne. That's and awesome. You know the other thing, too? that I like to point out with the man, with the slicer here, yeah. or with the dicer, is that when you use this, okay, over a tray like this, over the bowl, you can do your french fries and, you know, things that are shorter like potatoes, apples, carrots, cucumbers, you know, you push it through and you get those perfect french fries. But yeah. if you want longer pieces, like, let's say, for example, you've got one of those long English cucumbers and you want to make some cucumber icicles for the kids, take that blade out and use it by hand like this, look, place it over the top of your cucumber what? and press and look at this you get those long cucumber icicles the That's kids the, love these things that would look great that would look really good in shannon's in bloody case mary you miss this <laughs> oh sorry we can, all you do is place it over the top and press down shannon look, look at what he's that. doing <laughs> you get those long That's cucumber the coolest icicles. thing ever or you can do the same thing Let with zucchini. One of these things. hey maybe you're grilling you zucchini and you want to do something different look those long zucchini sticks like this Look Perfectly at that. On the Isn't that awesome? Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, and if you don't like the seeds, you just take the seed part out and you throw that part away and you eat the rest it's of so it. It's so much fun. All right. Hey, John, great yes. job as always. We got to, we have to lasso John. He just, he gets carried away. I do. He has so much fun with this machine <laughs> and you will too. Hey, listen, we already offered a good deal, but if you want to get $10 off and get it for $19.95, you can. All you need to do is get an HSN credit card. It's easy to do. All you need, you might say, how do I get a credit card? All you do is you call us and, or you hit that little button and we'll send it out to you. Shannon will drive it to your house. Yeah. And you'll have a credit card. How much will I save if I get an HSN credit card? A virtual fortune. Woo! $10 off. I love it. That is a virtual fortune. All right. Speaking of saving a virtual fortune, we've got a today's special too. And when we have a second today's special, that means it really is an amazing value and something that every home needs to have. The retail value, close to $125. It's $89. What you'll find is this is a handheld blender that emulsifies, that purees, that chops into peanut butter like that. That's how powerful this is. What you aren't seeing is it's also, it's a handheld blender, but it comes with all the attachments you need to whisk up your omelets, to whisk up, to, to blend up your smoothies. To, seriously, wait, were those peanuts or almonds? These were peanuts and I did it with oh one gosh. hand. Right? One hand. And you can keep going if you like it creamier, but 
I mean, have you ever seen a hand blender that will do peanut butter? No. I know big clunky, you know, countertop blenders that yeah. literally in the instruction manual says don't do nut butters because it jams up the motor. Sure. So you're getting 400 watts literally in the palm of your hand. That's more than most stand mixers. That's more than many blenders. And this is literally in the palm of your hand. Now, let me show you all the things that you can do. This happens to be your chopper attachment. Mm -hmm. You're getting a two-year warranty because this is bronze, so you don't ever have to worry about quality with brawn. Look at that creamy peanut butter. I mean, when you look at the back of a jar of peanut butter, there's chemicals, there's preservatives, there's all kinds of stuff in there that you just simply don't want in there. Now, this was one ingredient, Shannon. Oh my gosh. Plus the fact that now you're making all those gourmet nut butters yes. and they're so expensive. Or your little cocoa they're powder like or a little cinnamon $12 or something. $12 for really like so a little much. pint yeah. of the or organic. By the way, this is Kelly Deedring. I didn't even introduce you. I was so, I was like obsessed. I, was I know, like, it's peanut butter. On the peanut butter. That's really cool. And this is the power. It's the power right in the handle. Watts. So lightweight and yet so powerful. The extra added value comes in the puree handle, which we're going to show you in a second. But this is what we think of. And you think you would get this, an emulsion blender for $90, right? Oh, it's crazy. So normally you would spend about $100 just with the blending wand alone. Now, once I get through this first layer of fiber, this is going to blow your mind, okay? 400 watts is taking all of those fruits and vegetables and turning them into a smoothie without adding any liquid. Now, most blenders, you would need a liquid. Look at the vortex it's creating. It's literally pulling wow. in all the fruits and vegetables to the wand itself. So you can see, I, I quit moving my arm up and down. Yeah, because I don't have to do any of the work. Now, let me stop and show you what you'd be doing with most immersion blenders. Mm -hmm. Or maybe you call it a stick blender, or a hand blender, whatever you call it. You'd be going up and down and round and round. You'd, you'd be standing back because you'd be worried about yeah. splatter. That's not going to happen because of this power bell technology. It's exclusive to brawn. And watch as I just push this into my smoothie and I pull that smart speed trigger. It pulls it all into the, the, the uh, blade on its own. I don't have to do any of the work. Love it. Now, what, what I'm talking about smart speed is actually where my fingers are right here. So the more I pull, the higher the speed, right? Most stick blenders or hand blenders, you would have to stop. Dial up a new speed, start over. Uh. Dial up a new speed and start over. Okay. With brawn, the, the harder you pull, the faster it goes. So think about it like your gas pedal on your car, right? Uh. The harder you push, the more you're speeding, right? That's it's, what happens here. It's also really, really easy. So if you have a hard time holding on, you have some dexterity issues, yep. you'll find that it's very simple to use. Um, also, how easy is it to clean? So all of the attachments pop off, just like you saw me doing, and they go in the dishwasher or with my blend ending one, I just rinse it under the tap, okay? Yeah. It's stainless steel. The only thing that doesn't go into the dishwasher, obviously, is the motor. Right. But this it's is not splashing up either, so it's not really getting on the handle. Most stick blenders, I swore them off, I wrote them off. Yeah. I, I have a lot of kitchen appliances, and I hated immersion blenders. Right. I hated them because I was afraid of them. With a hot soup, it would splatter everywhere. Right. That's not going to happen with brawn. It's this power bell technology that stops the splatter. It's the 400 watts that makes everything pull pull itself into the blade, and it's the smart speed, where all I do is pull, so it's designed to be used one-handed, right? Mm -hmm. So with something like, you can see a boiling hot soup, mm -hmm. the only appliance that would work here is an immersion-style blender, right, or a hand blender. You would not be able to do this in any other appliance over a stovetop in this vessel. You can take your, your, your wand, your blending wand, to any vessel that you want. Now, you can see I've stopped moving the wand. The wand is pulling all the ingredients into the blade. Wow. How crazy is that? Now, you can hear the harder that I pull on the trigger, the more power I get. I don't have to stop and switch speeds. All I have to do is pull a little harder. So could you, because you don't have to move it around on the bottom of the pan, I'm could you use anything. this with, a, you could use it with a nonstick pan? Oh, absolutely. Oh my you, gosh. Can, you can leave it right in the liquid, not even touching the bottom. And you can see, just showing you as I add in my cream, it is literally creating a hurricane or a vortex if you will. <laughs> and that went from onion and um, and um, butternut squash and a little cream to a beautiful homemade fresh organic soup. Wow. In seconds. I mean, when you have something like an immersion blender, all of the tasks in the kitchen suddenly become easy. They become mm. less cumbersome. I don't have to get out a big clunky blender to do a beautiful right? smoothie. It, all I have to do is get out my motor. It comes with that cup, by the way. This is everything that you're getting. So you get that attached cup if you want to be able to mix your smoothies right in here. 
of course you can actually mix it right in any cup that you've mm -hmm. got. This is the puree attachment, a $25 value that only comes with our HSN, our HSN configuration. Any place else you'd have to purchase it separately. We'll show you how that works as well. This is the hand blender with that amazing smart sensor of the handle. So you control how powerful it is. There's the vortex right there. So that's your traditional hand mixer. That's normally what you would get for $99. You're to whisk up the most beautiful omelets. That's a tap, that comes with it. And then that chopper attachment comes with it as well. It's $17.99 on any major credit card. We will ship it to you for free. So you're saving $10 off the original price, but you're getting a $25 puree attachment and we're shipping it to you for free, which is another $7.95. You get everything that you see here and a manufacturer's two-year warranty. You get the use and care manual. So simple. Yeah. To, like, it's everything so easy to pop except everything for the base. on and off. Yeah, all goes in the so dishwasher. So two-year warranty off. is crazy with something that plugs in. Typically, they give you 60 or 90 days, right, into yeah. the kitchen, right? A so long we're giving plug you two well. years. Oh yeah, very like, I long really plug. Like that. So you can take this all around the kitchen. I love this chopper attachment. So you can see on the inside, I have tomato, I have onion, I have cilantro, I have a hot pepper, and then some salt and pepper and a little lime. It's literally five ingredients. Now, ready for this? I can pulse it. I have complete control because I am attached up here just pulling the trigger on the blending wand. Now, if you like a chunkier salsa, you could probably stop right about there. That was, what, three or four pulses? Mm -hmm. But pop that back on, and if you really want to go to more of a restaurant style, more of a creamy liquid salsa, look at the results that you get. Now, when you go to the grocery store, look how beautiful that is, mm -hmm. and you purchase a jar of salsa, there's chemicals in there, there's preservatives in there, there's added sodium. I've even seen salsa with added sugar. So if mm. you're trying to eat healthier, if you're trying to limit things like sodium yeah. or sugar or whatever, you maybe don't like it extra spicy. You now can create the most beautiful, fresh homemade salsa literally in seconds with five ingredients, and then you can serve out of this dish. Look how pretty this dish is, right? It is it's really a one nice. and a half cup dish. So you could even serve right out of that if you were taking it to a party or you were mm -hmm. hosting a party. And then when I take off that chopper and I literally just pop this on, I mean, you can see how easily everything yeah. goes on. This is the freebie. This is the $25 value that only at HSN you can get, right? Mm -hmm. Because everywhere else you're going to spend $100 for the bundle and it doesn't include this. Okay. So here, Why do we need this? This is awesome as a puree attachment. So if you're somebody that wants to do avocado toast, guacamole, mashed potatoes, oh mashed God, cauliflower, uh -huh. this is our baby food like um, stewed apples or applesauce or pears or peas, broccoli. You can soften them and then puree them literally in a couple of seconds. Now, as I pull harder, you're going to see that extruding attachment work faster, right? And you're going to get a creamier result. Look at the top there. It's also wow. aerating it. So you don't have to hand mash anything or get out a blender anymore. You can just pop on your puree tool and have anything pureed in a matter of seconds. Oh I use goodness. it a lot for avocado, just like you saw me do here. And I also do a cauliflower and a mashed potato. So then you're just gonna sort of scrape out the, yeah, the just avocado. Yeah, the top off there. And then you and can then rinse it off or yep, you can rinse stick it, it in the dishwasher. It's very, dish it's dishwasher safe. So what, are there, there are just two little buttons on the side? And you just pop everything on and off. There you literally, go, and then it, it just literally clicks. couldn't be easier. It's not, I mean, this is, I mean, look what I'm pulling and pushing it off. So even if you've never used an immersion style blender and you're thinking, well, is it hard to use? It couldn't be simpler. And this is a two-year warranty. This motor is hand balanced. That might not sound like anything, but in a manufacturing world, everything is stamped out by machines. Braun literally has a pair of human hands that touch every motor to make sure it is the most sophisticated, finest quality machine that you're gonna get home. In fact, we invented the hand blender. We were the very oh. first to come out with it. And to this day, people don't switch brands. I've talked to people on the phone here at HSN that have called in and said, I'm buying this one because mine that I'm using is 20 years old. Oh, they yeah have their brawn for 15 yeah. and 20 years. <laughs> well, That's this is insane. This is from the original maker, yep. but it's also new technology with that Vortex technology. What you saw in the video was they were moving it all around. Yep. Once it starts the Vortex, you literally just don't have there. to move it. You just stand there and yep. hold it. And one of the great things about it being hand balanced is it's so easy to use. It's not straining your shoulder. You're not balancing that hand blender, you know, like an actual blender with two little mixer beaters, whatever 
exactly. you call that. Um, those can be really unwieldy. This stands on its own. It's $17.99 for you to get it home. And if you've never used an immersion blender, you're going to find so many uses for it. Oh. When you're when when you get the right texture of foods, you're eating them more. My favorite way to eat eat vegetables is in soups. Oh, yeah. Whether it's like a cold soup it's or so just hot it's or so yeah. incredibly healthy doing a super smoothie a day will, you know, really give you that energy that you are wanting. Okay. If you know anybody with a gluten allergy or anybody that's going gluten free, this is just 50 cents, maybe a quarter's worth of oats, right? Because oats okay. are very inexpensive. Yeah. This could have been almonds or chickpeas, brown rice, white rice, anything that's naturally gluten free, right? Okay. So pop it on the inside here, and now you have 400 watts in the palm of your hand. Now, many traditional big, chunky, clunky blenders wouldn't be able to rice this. It can take oats and turn it into rice flour, uh, excuse me, oat flour. Oat flour, oat flour which is gluten-free, and now I can make my fried chicken or my fried green oh my tomatoes gosh. or cupcakes gluten-free for my friends and family or myself, which, you know, that are going gluten-free. And again, that's so expensive. It's Just so like those expensive nut butters, they're all they're really costly. I was going to tell you, I did the math on that. It's like a 600% markup over traditional flour. Just and it's on gluten-free flour. And like, this is fresh. Yeah, like some of us who, you know, you have one person in your family who's gluten-free. Yeah. You're not going to use a whole thing of oat flour. Good it's going to get rotten before you use it all, and it's yep. so expensive. So expensive. Get that fresh flour whenever you need it in seconds. Now, this is just heavy cream. I'm going to make my own whipped cream. You could make your own mayonnaise. You could make your own meringue. This, you could do a dozen eggs. We did a dozen eggs inside this... Um, beaker. So the beaker is coming to you, but you can take the blending wand to any other vessel that it fits yeah. inside, which is pretty much everything. You can see how, uh, but look at that whipped cream now. In just nice. a matter of seconds, I have turned heavy cream into my own fresh whipped cream. I don't have to buy it in the aerosol yeah. can anymore. Such a big difference It's such a big difference when it is fresh. And you can sweeten it with whatever you want. If yep. you wanted to use an artificial sweetener, I like to sweeten my um, mine with um, Bailey's. Oh, okay. Irish cream. I love that idea. Yeah, you get your own <laughs> flavored amazing. whipped cream, right? Hey, it's flavored never too early in the morning creams. for That's Bailey's right. whipped cream. Well, also dessert. So there's sweet potatoes, brown sugar, cinnamon, and an egg on the inside mm. here. We're going to make a beautiful sweet potato pie. But this could be brownie mix, cake mix, cheesecake batter. I mean, this could be pizza dough, you know, on the inside here for those little mini personal pizzas. Whatever now you want to do, you're getting free, basically, the one and a half cup chopper to do anything oh that you wish. Now you don't have to get out the cutting board and the knife and slice and dice everything. Mm -hmm. All you have to do is pop it into your chopper and you're good to go. And if you looked up electric choppers, what are you spending? $50, oh $60? Gosh. Right. So this is your electric chopper. You're spending $50, $60 on an electric chopper yep. and then on an electric whisk. I don't even think I've seen no, one. I mean, you can't that whisk amazing? it fast enough. I can't whisk whipped cream fast enough to make it turn not into a, cream. Not in whisk. Absolutely. Right? The emulsion blender on its own, you could spend $100 on it, not even a brawn. And then that puree attachment, the attachment on its own is $25. Yep. So really, BPA-free plastic, you don't have to worry about that. This is all about eating healthier, preparing your fresh foods faster. The Braun Quick Mix model on its own, $100, yep. like we were saying. And yep. then that masher puree tool is another $25. So instead of spending close to $125 today, it's under $90. We'll ship it to you for free, and it's $17.99. As with everything, you've got 30 days to try it out, but you've got a full two-year warranty, warranty on which, this. And read the review. I mean, it's, I think, like, something oh, like ridiculous four and a half customer. stars. Okay. Yeah. People absolutely love it. The value alone, just to get a brawn to your home for under $100, brawn is the most high-end, sophisticated brand mm. we think of when we think of immersion blenders, right? They just are. You know that name. You love that name. You trust that name. Read the reviews, get it home, and try it. If you don't own an immersion blender, like me, I hated them. I swore them off. Mm -hmm. They splattered. This one will change your mind. You will go, oh my goodness, what have I done without it for all these years? All right, so we just have our steamed potatoes, right? Or maybe you pressure cook your potatoes. Yeah. Whatever you want to do. So here is that puree attachment. Now watch oh as gosh. it extrudes the potato from the top to make the most fluffy, light, aerated mashed potatoes. Look at it coming out of the top. Not gummy. Uh, have it's you not going to be gummy. Like, oh, it's not going to be gummy. sticky. It can be as chunky or as smooth or as creamy as you like. 
I mean, look at the results that you get just with potatoes, oh okay, gosh. alone. How beautiful is that? And now at this point, you could add in a little cream. If you're me, I always add sour cream. Mm. There's a little cream and a little butter um, with some seasoning. You can see there's a little bit of garlic in there. Oh, nice. But that's where you wanna add in your beautiful, um, you know, seasonings and then finish that mashed potato up. And my friends, you are gonna have restaurant style, aerated, fluffy and light, beautiful mashed potatoes better than anything you've had with any kind of mixer yeah. or wand. Oh my gosh, and you know when you're adding your own, you could add skim milk if you wanted to. Sure. You could add no milk, you could add almond milk, whatever you wanted to. Nothing wrong with that. mashed potatoes except for all the extra stuff that we usually add into it. Way better than powder, just the same as with oh, making fresh whipped cream, way better than that canned stuff. Um, really great treat for you, that's why it's our today's special too, so get it while well, we still have some left. Huge customer pick, oh that's why, God. oh, we're gonna enjoy. Oh my now, God, take that oh. with you. It is so good. All right, so I'm gonna eat a bowl of mashed potatoes for breakfast. <laughs> Thanks so much, Kelly. We all, we, of course, we have a two-year warranty on this, but if you want to extend that, you can add HSN Protection Plus. You get hassle-free protection, 24/7 customer service, no deductibles. You search Protection Plus at hsn.com, and of course, we always encourage you to add extra protection to those electronics. All right, we've got a showstopper now, so don't go anywhere because Guy is next. I have one word for this product and it's just awesome, okay? I've been waiting for somebody to invent something like this for a long time. It's what you call detail vacuuming, right? When you need to get into the hard to reach areas, little cracks, the crevices, places that you can't get a regular vacuum, what do you do? Well, you get hundreds of little teeny tiny vacuums and you put them inside a little tube and now they will, vacuuming, they will vacuum up all the dust while leaving things like jewelry and rings and the larger things that you don't wanna pick up. How do you get in those little cracks? You get the dust daddy. This is the Dust Daddy Deluxe. It's brand new here at HSN. It is perfect for those tight spots. Look at what you're getting here. So you get, it, it virtually attaches to any vacuum, so you don't have to worry about that, but you get the three-piece set. It allows you to focus the power. You get all that built in for a $20 bill. Carrie is here. Carrie yeah. Mobley is gonna show you some Good great morning. demonstrations. Good morning, wow. I will tell you though, this this is, when, I, when you look at it and you get it, you're like, what the heck is that? I know, well there's nothing like it, right? No, then you put it on your vacuum. Right. And you're like, it's like, and if you hold the tip of it and show everybody. Dozens. So it takes one vacuum hose and it turns it into all these, how many tubes are in there? 45 of 45 them. 45 little yep. vacuums. 45 little vacuums. So this is a dust daddy, I'm obsessed with it. I needed this the last time I cleaned my car and lo and behold, it was arriving at my house right on time. So what it is, is it's an attachment for your vacuum so all you need is your regular vacuum it fits nearly every single vacuum on the market it actually has a little piece on here that helps it fit universally every single vacuum right so you can fit it on there and and again we've got a nice ergonomic handle and then we have the tube adjuster which is going to allow us to figure out if we want really tight or whether we want them nice and flexible but let's just get right to it I just okay. want to show you how it works here so all forgive right. me now one of the things that's terrible is the silverware drawer right you get crumbs oh, yeah. in there and, and the coffee grounds. Thing, right? Well, no, and, and you never do, right? right? It just takes forever. And then somebody comes over to your house and they open it up and it's like, oh, how embarrassing. So we're going to take the dust daddy right. and it's just going to suck it oh, all yeah. right out of there. I don't have to move anything out. I don't have to the remove dust daddy. all of Look at the way the dust daddy works. There's nothing else like it. Now, instead of That's worrying brilliant. about whether or not I've got crumbs in there, because guys, I've got four boys. I love them to death. But but they're disgusting sometimes. And they'll be, you know, getting crumbs in here of when they're course. making toast. Their little look Cheeto at fingers. How, yeah, right, look at full. that. All it's right. perfect. Now let's <laughs> think about, let's think about your oh, oh, toolbox, right? That box. What is in there? That's oh, the yeah. stuff, right? Because this stuff is dirty. But what do you want? Are you going to dump all that out before right. you clean it? Watch, watch, right. watch, watch. So with all of these, like, these dozens of little tubes, yeah. I can get all of the sawdust out of here and not have to worry about what? whether or not I'm sucking up any of these pieces. It would take me forever to get all of this stuff out. But with the dust daddy, even the littlest, tiniest pieces you are going to be just You can just kick them off the fine. end, right? Yes, they don't get exactly. sucked up into the motor. And it's going to protect your valuables, too because when you start working with things like your tools, yeah. it gets lost now in the depth of your vacuum and you won't even know that you lost it. Next thing you know, you're like, where the heck 
Where did that thing go? I know I had it. And now with the dust daddy, check it out. Look at you that. Look at take you. care of all of it. I love it. All oh. right, here's what I'll tell you. It's brand new. Uh, it is on FlexPay. It's only $9.98 to get it home. And I would say... All, 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 all you do now is make the list of the things that you would use this for because there are so many different areas. I'm thinking, I'm, I see you have the dashboardy thing here, not oh, dashboard, but the console, you know, console center thing. console, yeah. You could do the dashboard too, right? You could do any of those little areas where something gets stuck down in a crack. Do you ever drop something and it gets stuck in the vent like above your window and you're trying to pull it out? You can suck it out with this because you're not going to hurt anything. You're going to pull stuff out. You want to get between the seats, underneath the seats mm -hmm. without sucking up a vacuuming, you know, and having it get stuck in without the head of your vacuum. Without sucking up your valuables that yeah, you might yeah, not yeah. No, or in there. Like Think a about, ring, right? What about your jewelry? I know. Well, first of all, for me, this is if you want to have a clean car, you know how difficult it is to get in this center console. I don't want to take all of my change out of there. Yeah. Watch the way the Dust Daddy works. It will just keep everything that you want to <laughs> stay in awesome. there, in there, and it'll take out everything you don't want. Look at the way, and even down in here, we right. can get everything out. Oh, I love it. The vents in your car. That's another great one. You can't ever get in those nooks and crannies. But with the dust daddy, listen, we've been waiting for this our whole yeah. lives. It's magic. Check out this keyboard over here. Right. You know, my son, Brett, I don't yeah. know what he does. I have no idea how he makes such a mess. But we always have, like, pencil shavings all over our keyboard. Check this out. It gets every nook and cranny, and all I have to do is hook that it up to my awesome. own vacuum cleaner. And, and Done. Gary, it even gets down in, in between the keys, right. too, which is a great deal. So think about, like, your computer keyboards. Think about areas. It could even be around your stove. If you get crumbs in and around your burners, right? Oh, and you're yes. like, and, that, and you can't get it out. You know, you're in there with a fork trying to try to use the dust daddy instead. It's a safer way to be able to get stuff out, and it allows you access to places that you normally wouldn't have. So look inside. Look at you! Look at this. Clean up my little pencil thing. You know, I, these are always disgusting, and a lot of times you either, A, you don't clean it, right? Look at the way it sucked up all of those pencil yeah. pieces and the dust that gets in there. Oh! I love it. And to yeah. be honest with you, it makes cleaning fun. Look at that. Yeah. This thing is awesome. Isn't it great? Right? And anything that, get, that gets wedged, you just kind of flick it off. Yeah. And it comes right off because, you know, these are all individual little vacuums. And that's how they work. So I want you to think about, like, little vacuum fingers, right? And so these will go into all the hard-to-reach areas that you have. And like I said, it could be in your car. It could be on your computer. It could be in your jewelry box. Things that you normally wouldn't clean out on a regular basis, you can now do. It's the detailed cleaning. What about vents? Vents are virtually impossible to clean unless you have a toothbrush or like a pipe cleaner. Yes. And I'm not that crazy that I'm going to go get a pipe cleaner. If somebody sees me cleaning my car with a pipe cleaner, they'll think I'm insane. <laughs> so uh, they'll be like, oh, hey, overdo it much. Uh, so, so you can do, utilize this for things like that. I love the fact that you, and you're going to do another I jewelry am. drawer, but the fact that you think about things like if you have silk plants or even have regular plants, regular plants with that big leaves and they get dust on them and you're trying to wipe that off, try the dust study on that. So here's a pretty example. We got yeah. lots of jewelry in here, right? You and would we got never. Lots of yep, you would I think never Brett, do Brett this. Brett was sharpening his pencil in your jewelry <laughs> box. Check this out, and I don't even have to remove anything. I can just move it around, yeah. get it out of my way, and all of this dust gets sucked up in here, so I don't have to painstakingly remove anything. Everything and, is safe. And all of my valuables. Same thing in your couch cushions, guy. Think about in between your couch cushions. Right. If you were to use a regular attachment to go deep into the cushions of a couch, what if there was money in there? What if there was a valuable, a ring, something like right. that? You now won't have to worry about that because of these dozens of tubes, suction, yeah. little suction tubes. And I just, I have to tell you, I, I could do this all day. I've got some more down here, if you don't mind. I'm just gonna yeah, keep let working me, uh, at let it. Let me remind everybody what our offer is again today as our, um, as our, uh, our uh, showstopper here today. We dropped it under $20. It's a $20 bill to get it home. It's a perfect attachment. If you're wondering, will it fit your vacuum? We say it'll fit almost every vacuum out there. If you get it and it doesn't fit, obviously return it, but I don't think you'll have any issue with that because if you have a standard vacuum, you should be fine. Uh, again, it's on FlexPay. It's $9.98. So where can you use this? You could use it anywhere. I mean, think about the places in your own home. And you know, each one of us have little areas that are, that are tough to vacuum or areas that we wouldn't even consider vacuuming. We'd dump it all out of them. We'd have to wipe it out. 
out. Yeah. But who has time to do that every single week or every, you know, twice a month? You don't want to deal with that. Use the vacuum. It's truly the best way to get in all the cracks and crevices. Uh, we're going to put three minutes up because we are extremely busy. Yeah. I mean, just crazy right now. I love it. It's because I've, you've never seen anything like this. You know, you'll see totally a detailing unique. tool with one, you know, they just shrink it down to one little. Right, but right. But then it's still big enough to suck Too up big. an earring. Yes. Or change or coins. This, they're so small, nothing will go in there but the dirt and the dust. So I've actually switched vacuums just to show you guys that here we have two different brands, two different styles of vacuum, and it was no problem with the Dust Daddy. It has this universal attachment on it right here uh -huh. that will help keep um, it, you know, from slipping yeah, so and you, coming off. Yeah, you exactly. Can see you have a Sometimes there, it'll work just right with this. Like that, right. But then we also give you the extra large one. So now it'll work and you'll see that grades down too. Exactly. So you have two special, you have two areas. You can adjust the suction right here. I don't know if you can see up close. There's a little uh, a little check valve here. And if you want super suction, you can do that. If you want to release it a little bit, you can do that. Mm -hmm. And then there's a guide on the top. Now this is to kind of splay out the right. fingers a little bit. So if you want them to move around like that, but then if you tighten it, and you just want it really concentrated, you move that all the way to the top, and then you've got all that vacuum power just like that. So like in the case of this, I want to have it nice and tight, and it's even sucking it out when I'm not touching it. It's using the power of your own vacuum. So if you love your vacuum, you will absolutely love the Dust Daddy. This might not be something that you use every single day, but you know if your husband or you are out in the garage and you're working, you've got sawdust all over your toolbox, look at the way that I can go around all these tiny pieces and still be getting this off. And yeah, like I said, if, if something gets hot, it's just because the suction is so strong. But check this out. Now this is spotless. We mentioned um, silk plants. Yeah. You would never do this with another attachment, with the, but with the Dust Daddy, you can see I can just do this right. running it over. And now for this, I would allow it to be a little bit more flexible. Right. And now I'm just gonna go along the whole plant that and I so don't have smart. to worry about the leaves getting sucked up into the vacuum and I can keep it nice and clean. Yeah. Same thing over here. Check this out. We've got the lampshade. How do you clean a lampshade? You know, I sometimes I, I throw it up, away and buy another one. I know, right? <laughs> but we love our things. Well, you we never want to think keep about them nice. cleaning it. I, I know. know. Yep. I know. Isn't that wonderful? It's perfect. All right, listen, guys. I know our clock is wearing down there, but we have just about 30 seconds left. If you'd like to get one of these, we'll send it out. A lot of you have questions about will it fit my vacuum? Well, we give you two different sleeves so that it'll adjust to different widths. Most vacuums have a standard attachment um, uh, circumference. You should be fine. Uh, again, though, we want you to be happy. So if you have any issues, just return it. And, you know, we'll, we'll hook you up any other way we can, but you're not going <laughs> to have that problem. So how does it work? Well, this I love this shot. This is like the, from the vantage point of the yeah. little tubes. It shows you how it gets in there and how it cleans it up very, very easily. Yep. All right. Bookshelves, oh, light took fixtures. Away our stuff. I, I wanted to, go to clean the, more. I was just going to go over and touch the desk, but they took it away. Anyway, anyway Carrie, good job. Thank really you, good thank job. You. All right, we're gonna, I'm going to toss it way over to Shannon and see what she's got going on way over there. This is what I got going on way over here. Come on over and look at my outfit. How cute is this shirt? And we match. You see right the little bit of turquoise a little in bit Shannon's of turquoise. cute as heck it's shirt? It's almost like we plan it like this. We're both wearing we jeans, this. like a little light jean, you know a little why? dark jean. You know jean. why? Because we're right here. We're right here. Right. We're, you know what? Co-hosts. It's like that same thing. We're on the same wavelength. Linked together. Right? Co-hosts. Yes. Cohesive. Um, why am I wearing this outfit, uh, guy? You don't know. Okay. Uh, um, customer because... appreciation month? Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Well, sure. Um, but also, Hillary Scott is going to be here from La Bella. Yeah. Right um, actually, I put it on my Facebook, and you voted for this yeah. outfit. It was really a hard choice. I couldn't decide between this. She's got some yeah. cute dresses. Yeah. This top is absolutely adorable. We're sort of scrolling here. Her fashion line, La Bella, it was actually inspired by her fans, and it combines a modern look with bohemian chic styles. Hillary Scott will be here tomorrow at one for her two-hour special, and of course, you can head to hsn.com to shop her full collection right now. Just search Hillary Scott. I like to go bohemian chic sometimes. Don't you? Yeah, I do. You think you got it going I'm on? Not, not really today, but I will. I'll All right. Get some fringe going. I'll be good to go. We'll be right, be right back. back. <laughs> There's no better love than customer love. Our customers make us head over heels happy. How do we love you? Let us count the ways. At HSN, our customers are a very big deal. So we filled the month with special savings, deals, exclusive offers for HSN cardholders, and even a few surprises. It's just our way of saying... Thank, thank you. you! Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Because the very best thing about us... Is you.
Okay, where were you in the last emergency? In fact, where was your light source? For me, it was in the flashlight drawer and the battery was dead. So that didn't really help at all. I really could have used these. This is from Bell & Howell. You're actually getting a set of three, no batteries necessary ever. These are the torchlight crank flashlights. They're a huge customer pick because guess what? They are always ready. All you do is give it a few little cranks and you get amazing torchlight. You're getting three for $19.95. Guess what? That makes them each about $6.65. They're a really great compact size. You just choose if you want three blue, three red, or three black, and they even come in gift boxes as well. So my guest, Lou Caputo, is here to show us what you don't need. What you don't need, mm -hmm. say bye-bye batteries. We don't bye -bye. need these anymore. Bye-bye yeah. batteries. Because you don't know if don't these are them. alive or dead. No, or, you never uh, know. That's the thing. You, you could have a flashlight in a drawer for months, years without using it, and the first time you go to use it, dead batteries, okay? Never gonna happen with our crank flashlights because let me show you how these work, all right? Well, look, let's look at the features first, all right? Take a look at this. When you see these, okay, first of all, three super bright LEDs, and I'll show you those in just a second. You just turn the handle that's on the back. It stows away, but it has a dynamo inside that's gonna charge these up. One switch operation, that's all there is, on or off. Nothing to worry about there. And then it's got the wrist strap so you don't drop them. So when you look at these, I want you to notice how tiny they are. I've got one in the palm of my hand right nice. there. Nice. Look how absolutely tiny that is, okay? There's the on-off switch I was talking about, and all you have to do is just slide that forward like that. It turns the lights on. Push it backwards, they go off. Push it forward, they go on. Three LEDs in there. Now, there are no batteries in this that you ever have to replace. The way that it gets power is, on the back right here, is a little tiny crank. You pull that out, just like that, and all you do is give it a couple twists. And so as couple, I'm doing this. Like how much do we have to crank? Actually, it's surprising. I'll show you in just a second. I've got one that's completely dead. You just give it a couple of cranks and it comes on. It stores the power and the batteries in here. The neat thing about that though, is that look at that. It lasts and lasts and lasts. We literally had one out here the last time we did a presentation all night long. And it never went out. It got really, really super dim, but it never went out. And then when we wanted to use it again, just tuck the crank out. <laughs> Gave it a couple twists and done. So you can have these in your glove compartment, in your toolbox, your tackle box, your junk drawer, your bedside table, and never have to worry that it's not going to work. Because that's the, I mean, that's the big concern. It's a huge you know, frustration. the lights go out or you just need that yes. extra light. What about the batteries? And when those batteries are kind of dead and you're like this, your <sighs> flashlight, right? You never have that. You turn it on. If it's a little bit dim or it's been a while, you just give it a couple little twists. This is $9.98 today on Flex. If you have an HSN card, you can get an extra Flex, $6.65. And fit in your pocket. It's a like wrist strap. Purse, I love that. Backpack, briefcase, anywhere you want to put this. And the nice thing about it, you're holding one in your hand right now. Doesn't it feel awesome in the hand? Yeah, it's a nice like a soft sort it's of a, a soft It's a feel. soft rubberized finish. Uh -huh. Almost feels like a little suede, suede. on the outside. Yep. Isn't it crazy? Say, it's like but it's rubber. Finish. But it's yeah. neat the way it feels like that. And the nice thing is because it is so small, you're going to have one everywhere. You're getting a set of three and they are individually gift box. So these are great gifts either for three separate people or if you want to keep them for yourself or you just want to distribute them have one in every single car now i mentioned i had one flashlight that's totally dead okay so yeah. here this particular flashlight watch this i'm going to flip the switch forward okay see flip the switch forward nothing's happening the battery's totally dead now in a normally in a situation like this you start to panic do i have batteries do i have to run out to the store and buy batteries no i'm going to take the crank out i'm leaving this in the on position on purpose because i want you to see something as i start to crank this it comes back to life. Now, I'm using the power. See, it's going to still slowly go out. I'm using the power as fast as I create it. But oh. if I turn the switch to off, and then we just stand here for a couple seconds, and I just give it a couple of cranks. And mm -hmm. it's, not, it's not hard to do. It doesn't take very long, and we don't have to sit here all day. Okay, that's probably enough. Watch this. Ready? Boom. Look how bright that is. Look how it's staying on. And, and that's three super bright LEDs. If I turn that on my shirt, you can see how bright that li uh, light is compared to our studio lights. So you're getting a light here that's gonna be incredibly versatile and something you can mm. use every single day. Yeah, you really will. And it's that peace of mind, knowing that it's there whenever you need it. It doesn't take up much space as well. So you can have one in your bedside table, you can have mm -hmm. one in the bathroom, you can have one in the closet, wherever you need it. I like how in that video it showed them using that light to be able to open the door, to be able to put your key in the door. How bright is it? It's bright enough to be able to see whatever you're looking at. It's not gonna light up an entire room, 
this no. is not that mile far flashlight. You can tell, but you've got three LEDs and you know you've always got light. It doesn't matter. How long does it last? You crank it up and then you're able to use that light. So you're never without batteries. That's really the point of this. Yeah. You get to choose blue or red or right. black. And I like that they come in gift boxes. What a great gift. I think it's awesome. It's six bucks and 65 cents a piece. Absolutely. And it's substantial too. It doesn't feel like a cheap little flashlight that you picked up at the checkout counter on the way out of the store. You know, and I've got flashlights yeah. here in my hands. When you look at these guys, yeah, I mean, th like this one will probably shine the light forever. I mean, just a, a really great distance. Big D size batteries, heavy, they get dead. They cost yeah. a lot of money. These little guys right here, these are the kind you usually keep in the junk drawer. Okay, again, dead batteries. And the worst part is that when the batteries get dead, they start to corrode, and then you ruin the flashlight oh, too. Yeah. That's never gonna happen with your crank flashlight. This light is always going to work every single time you need it. And if it does run out of power, what am I gonna do? Take out that crank, <laughs> give it a couple turns. I'm not gonna go to the store. I'm not gonna spend all that money on the batteries to get these. So when you need this, it's gonna fit in the pocket, you know, very easily. Now, a lot of people out there, I know what you're doing. You're sitting there going like, I got a light on my cell phone. I just use a little flashlight in the back of my cell phone, mm. really. I can't get my cell phone to last an entire day. Am I gonna really <laughs> use the battery for a light when I have something like this with three LEDs? My cell phone has one LED. That doesn't True. throw out a ton of light. Yeah. This three LEDs, much more powerful. And again, I don't have to worry that I can't make a call on this because guess what? Well, f number one, it's not a phone. But number right. two. <laughs> it does one thing, right? It does it one does thing and it does it, does it really, really well. well. It and does. all you do is just crank it like this. You get that power yeah. back and boom, there you go. And how easy is it to use the crank? I yeah. mean, it's so simple. It really, anybody can do it. Exactly. It's a small little crank yeah. but made out of plastic. So when you think about it, you're not, you know, you're not, it's not like you're, you know, I don't know, pumping water in the olden days, yes. right? This is no, no, like uh, one finger cranking here. If I could right. get the angle Look right. That. Look at uh, that. That's it. There you go, right? Very, one very finger, simple to do. Right? Yeah, so easy to do. And $19.95, and remember, you're getting three. It's a huge customer pick because if you, if you never use it, although you will, you'll use it a lot oh, more than you lot. think. You really will. Knowing that it's there, yeah. and knowing that it's not, you don't, well, have to, you don't have dead batteries in the flashlights, it's the worst. And I'll give you, a, for instance here, well, last hurricane, I forget which one it was, Irma or the other one, yeah. whatever. We yeah, went through so bad. many of them. Right, but we went, you know, my wife and I like to be prepared. We have like our wise food products and we have yeah. all, you know, we have all that good stuff, sure. right? including a tub full of batteries, okay? Now, we hadn't had a hurricane in a couple of years, so those batteries may have been sitting for a while. And all I know is when we went in there and we started taking those batteries out, some of those batteries that we spent a lot of money on were looking a little funky, if you know what I'm saying. They're getting a little fuzzy around right. the edges. And so now I'm sitting here thinking to myself going, oh, great, so I prepared a while ago, and now that we're actually having a situation, I don't have a flashlight that I know 100% is gonna work. Guess what? If you have these flashlights, if you have the crank on the side, you're always gonna have a flashlight that works. Nothing worse than being stuck on the side of the road on a dark night with mm -hmm. a dead battery and not having a light. Sure, try the cell phone light, it's not a bunch of light. This is going to give you that light you need. Three super bright LEDs in this. And again, look at the size. Fits in a pocket, fits in a purse, gonna fit in your glove compartment, your center console, the kids' backpacks. I mean, wherever you wanna put these, they're gonna fit. Yeah, and you're getting three. Why, yeah. why do we need three? I mean, you know, you think I've got a flashlight like this, right? <laughs> it's a little bit better for like wielding right. off bad guys, but because um, you know it's not gonna work. But, but why do you need three? So think of all the places you wanna put them. I mean, do you want one in your junk drawer? Yeah, do you wanna have one maybe by your uh, breaker box? Absolutely, That's do you wanna keep yeah. one in a toolbox or a tackle box? Yes, do you wanna have one in your go kit in your car there so when your tar car breaks down, you got a flashlight? Absolutely, kids backpack, yes. Bedside table, mm -hmm. uh, junk purse, drawer. Purse, right? Yeah, purse, yeah. pocket, I mean, that's the thing about this. And in fact, if I step out to the side over here, all right, I'm just gonna put this in my pocket and I just want you to see something. Look at the way that fits in this pocket. You don't even know it's there. No, it's You can't really even see that it's discreet. there, but boom, pops right out. So it's a perfect size to carry with you all the time. Yeah, it really is great to be able to get three, even if you think, I only need one flashlight. Well, give the other two away. They're $6.65, and, yeah. and they come with a gift box. I've bought gift boxes for things. You can't even buy a gift box for $6.65. No. Good look at the so, holidays trying to get one. Oh, right? you know what holiday's coming up? Speaking Father's of which. Father's Day. Yes. Father's Day, I was thinking yes. about that. Father's Day, and you know who also will use this? So, Mom. Oh, yeah. Like if you, I mean, Mother's Day's coming up as sure. well. Of course, you think, oh, you think flowers and brunch and things like that. Trust me on this. I'm a mom. 
mom and one of the worst things as a mom is to be unprepared when you've got people who are relying on you to be able to show them where you're going. You don't want to be like, oh, ha, I forgot to buy batteries. Or, oh, the, like in the last hurricane, all the stores are you out of batteries. You couldn't find a battery. You couldn't buy a battery nope. to save your life. This will always be that perfect light for you. So lightweight, you can carry this with you anywhere you go, and it's always at the ready. Yeah. Even if you just buy it to save the money on batteries, heaven's sakes, it's a big customer pick. But you know who else loves flashlights? Kids. Kids love yeah. flashlights. I love to play with them, yeah. especially in the summertime. I remember when I was a kid running around outside flashlight with my friends tag. at night. Flashlight You're tag. Right. Exactly. Mm -hmm. But you know what? This. You start running into that battery problem when they, all the kids have flashlights. This way you're getting three, give one to each of the kids. These are really, really durable, rubberized on the outside, and you're never going to have to buy batteries. Like I said at the beginning, bye-bye batteries. You don't have yeah. to buy them anymore. I love it. Bye-bye, no more bye -bye buying batteries. batteries. Yep. You know what's great about kids playing flashlight tech, and I love it. Anything that gets the kids outside, yeah, yeah, I'm all for it. But you know who doesn't tell you that the batteries are dead in the flashlight? Who? The kids uh, and <laughs> the husband, true. no offense. Um, but they put them back, and you know where they put them? Where? The batteries are dead? Back in the flashlight drawer. So you go to get the flashlight, nothing. Yeah, nothing. This way, you always have nothing. light wherever you need it. No more batteries. Yep. This is truly that emergency flashlight. A really nice, easy to use crank, and then you've got that power. Yeah. So definitely get it. You're getting three, you will use all three. Blue, red, or black. I say choose the ones that are brightest until we're sold out, because yeah. you see it anywhere. Like when you need flashlight, you, you it. want it to be nice and bright. You definitely won't lose it. Right. And it's even got that little wrist strap as well, so you can carry it with you wherever yes, you go. Yes, they do. Nice. $9.98 to get those home. Lou, thank you You're so very much. Welcome. My pleasure. This is a great solution I for like everybody. Yeah. I think every house should have one of these or three of these, actually. Yep, three of them. <laughs> All right. Um, thanks so much. All right. Guy is up next. He's got some great.